All right, so the next NCAA tournament team we're going to be discussing is going to be Stetson, winners of the ASUN Conference as of today. They've got a 22-12 record on the year, 11-5 in the conference. Not bad. Actually scheduled some tough non-conference games. We'll get into that in a second. Currently projected as most likely a 16 seed, depending on what goes down with other conferences. Could see them bump up to a 15. But let's go ahead and get to it, okay? So as you can see on your screen, all right, they have losses to UNLV. All right, that's – Kind of a bubble loss, not exactly a tournament loss, but it could turn into one. Uh, you've got a loss to Houston. All right, big loss there, 30-point loss, but who are we kidding? Houston beat Kansas like this yesterday, so not a bad loss at all. All right, but you do have wins over Central Florida. All right, so that's a not tournament team, but that is a Big 12 team. That's a Power 5 team. All right, you've got a close loss to Charlotte. All right, well, not a close loss, but a loss to Charlotte. Charlotte is not a tournament team as well, but kind of – have a good resume, I guess the way I would put it. Uh, they're like third or fourth in the American, and they also down here have a win against Charlotte, you'll see as well, so they do kind of split that game. You have a single-digit loss to Cincinnati, which is also a Big 12 team, which is kind of on the bubble, so not a bad loss there. Not really a bad non-con resume, to be honest with you. Uh, actually have some okay wins and not bad losses as far as quad one losses are concerned, you know. Uh, but Chicago State, that's a questionable loss. But overall, though, they get through the conference and then defeat the eight seed Queens University of Charlotte, 10 seed Jacksonville University, and the four seed Austin P. Stetson was the two seed in their conference. But overall, like I said, 22 and 12, depending on their matchup, if they could somehow squeeze and get to a 15 seed, I think they could play with the right to at least keep it close because uh, they have experience playing these bigger schools. So it's not going to be just a shock when they see these speeds and the size that's going to be coming at them from the Power Six. Uh, so I think they could keep things interesting for a little while in round one, depending on who they get to play. Uh, not saying they'll beat them necessarily, but I think they could keep it close and make things interesting. But probably ultimately, though, getting dipped in the first round. But I think they are capable of playing with a first round team. But let me know your thoughts on Stetson down in the comment section. Are they a one and done? Can they pull an upset bid on a one or two seed? Let me know. Comment down below. Make sure to like this video and subscribe.